And I'm back. Oh yes, I am back. This guy's having trouble sleeping again. So yeah, the thing is, I have other profiles on this game, so I'm not going to get any of the achievements unless if I somehow do something I don't have the achievement for yet. But uh, I'm kind of okay with that because it would be distracting. But generally, you get one achievement for putting out your campfire because it means your fire's safe. All right, well, I'm already further along than I was before. By now you get the gist, so I'm just going to skip this guy's stuff. Take it in dandy. Wouldn't believe how many revisions he demanded. Hmm. Sounds like a shitty client. Oh, the, oh yeah, Spectre Knight. Shit. <laughs> Let's talk to this guy. King Knight reigns no more? Huzzah! Now I can rule Pride more. Hurrah! I can't wait to greet old Plume and Brigi. Can't they probably can't wait to see me. About that. You know what? Never mind. You'll figure it out. <laughs> yeah, it's assumed that those are his uh, friends that you brutally murder. This thing's pretty good if you're getting overwhelmed uh, from both sides because it bounces around. But otherwise it's pretty shit and you generally want to stick with this to keep them at a distance. For now, this is all I'll have to buy, so yeah. Ooh, look at those meats. Also, you can stand literally a pixel on an object. And that's really cool. I like that they let you do that. It's different from normal coyote timing in platformers, which coyote time is basically the principle of you drop off a ledge, but you still have a second to jump from where you jump off the ledge. Instead of giving you normal coyote time like that, the game just makes it to where you can stand really far uh, on a ledge, like near the exit. And because of that, it's not real coyote time, but it's still like you're jumping. There's also an achievement for doing this a bunch. Which I think I would have just gotten doing that. Uh, I think it might be like 10 seconds or something. I never talked to you. Shovel Knight, many trials await you. Don't despair. May each defeat strengthen your resolve. Each defeat would kill me. These guys are trying to kill me. Ooh, who are you? I haven't talked to you. Me, that old witch down in the juice bar? She tells fortunes, but she won't talk to me. Weird. Oh yeah, here's something fun. If you're on like a trail space like here, then an enemy can randomly go into you. Which we're gonna be doing all of these levels as they appear. Ooh, I didn't think this guy would survive that. Whoa! Calm the fuck down. Oop. One moment. I know you're attacking me, but I gotta I gotta get this treasure mate. There we go. Got him. Uh ooh. Uh. Oof. Don't like that, guys. See, normally they don't walk off the edge, so I, I didn't know that that guy in the first level would do that. Well, fuck that guy. He didn't want me to have his treasure. Boom. Those guys never show back up, so... 
Once you beat him, that's it. Alright, well now that that distraction's over... Let's go to the list yard. Let's get shoveling! Yeah! Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's sweet music, though. Fuck. Got him. Run away! Run away from the ghosty goo with a hat! Good hat, by the way. Ah, bomb. Ah, bomb. So yeah, this level first introduces you to the bombs. And that's cool. Darn it. So these red skeletons behave differently than the normal skeletons. They will charge forward after you hit their head off. Yes! Got him! Whoop! There's a thing here. I don't remember this being here. Okay. And there's nothing else, so we're going back down. Got him. Uh oh, that doesn't look good. Ah! Ooh. Get outplayed. Man, it's been a while since I've seen the classic version of this level. <sighs> okay. Oh yeah, something important to know is that I played Pyre on the easiest difficulty setting because I'd never played the game before. That's not always going to be the case. Uh, in this case, there's only one difficulty setting, but I have played the for game before, so it's really easy. Here's also the part with the uh, thunder sounds, by the way. Nasty. Okay, there's nothing over there. Let's look in here. Okay, nothing over here. Yeah, I thought there was something. That's why I stopped. Yes! Got all four of them! Oh yeah! That's a instant death hit, by the way. Let me just wipe my hands off. I could die here! Okay, cool. I thought that made three ghosts, but I guess not. Crap, messed it up. There we go. <laughs> I don't like that part of the level. I don't like any part of any level that does that. Also, my uh, virus skin is now running. That's cool. That may have just froze. Ah oh, well, can't be helped.
And I mean the graves. Interesting concept. Oh, but now there's two of them. Ow. So yeah, the thing is, the skeletons with these giant heads... Uh... Essentially, they act as weight even when you're not having to wait. So yeah. What's down here? Alright. Um... There we go. So those spikes in the ceiling are instant death spikes too, so it's kind of tricky. That was kind of jarring, but all right. Gotcha! Oh, I messed it up. Supposed to be able to go the other way. Hey, hang on, enemies respawn! Yay! Ow. Ah! Bad guy. What do I do? In the village around the field I have all the deals. You're not gonna believe what I found. Oh yeah. This is one of the most important items in the game. Yeah, fucking hate frog enemies. Why are they always? They always take more than one hit, which is the stupidest design decision that everyone always makes. Is you have the enemy with the awkward pattern, but it always takes two hits, not one. Eh, whatever. At least I can break this and get all of the monies. Oh fuck you! God, I hate that enemy. Wasn't even near it and it hit me. No, I know I can make that jump. There we go. You don't want to let the platform into the bottomless pit because then you're going to get trapped. Because the skeleton skull will disappear. Oh, how did you get back here? You'd think the helmet would protect the, their heads or something. This is the sort of almost, almost losing fish action that you've come to expect from the Traveler. Oh, I did not know that. Oh, well, I'm down here now.
We're just gonna pretend that was on purpose. Got him. Alright, well I think it's safe to say at this point... Well, shit. <laughs> I think it's safe to say at this point that, assuming I don't dive to Spectre Knight, which is a possibility, uh, I may be good to complete this level. Oh wait, there's one more section for the, uh, for the, that, that, for that, for what that frog just learned firsthand. Okay. I didn't know where I was. I <laughs> that was bad. Whew. There's usually always one of those things hidden. One of those chicken things. Which I learned that in the first level, so then now I all I always found them. Except I think for like one level I could never find it, but... Oh yeah, Pride More Keep! In Pride More Keep I could never find it. High Spectre Knight. This is no place for the living, mortal. You shall be summoned when it is your time. And everyone has, we t has a time, as we saw with your beloved shield knight. LIES! I won't believe such talk from phantoms. Your very existence is a vile deception. <laughs> the enchantress is just full of surprises. She granted me new life. So that I may take yours! Bad guy. Come on then. Okay, I jumped. That moment when you jumped, but you didn't jump according to the game. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> ah, fuck you. Ah. Oh, fuck you, that should have worked! Piece of shit has more range than I do. Good job, you definitely hit me. Come on! <laughs> Ooh, that was weird. Why do you kill all of his guys? Ow. Get dunked on! Ooh, this is pushing 20 minutes. In, in about a minute. <laughs> Ooh, a chest. I'm gonna want that. Can I get that chest? No? Okay. I'll hold up now. <gasps> it's another is another one of these. Ah, bad guys. Holy crap, that was a lot. Uh... Oh, damn. I don't I, I've never gotten it to the point where I've 
failed to rescue her during all these cutscenes. I guess nothing happens, which is good, because that could have easily just been, oh, you die, because because you you failed. But but no, uh, it's whatever, I guess. But it did get a lot of money for it, and that's good. Goodbye.